Scripture, put on the whole arm of God that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. <coughs> Ephesians 6.11 What steps can you take to guard yourself? I can read God's word to strengthen my faith. I can pray for God's protection over my life. I can seek out opportunities to draw me closer to God. I can pray for God's protection over my life. How to battle fear, devotional, submit first. Submitting to the Lord is our first line of defense when fear wears its ugly head. And guess who loves it when we live in fear? Our spiritual enemy. Fear is his playground. Thankfully, we have a plan of attack. God has given us a, a, a spiritual dress code in Ephesians 6, 11, 18. We must be fully equipped with the belt of truth, the breastplate of righteousness, shoes of the gospel of peace, the shield of faith, the helmet of salvation, the sword of the spirit, and a prayer for heart. Once we have appropriately clothed, we can heed the words of James, the half-brother of Jesus. Submit yourselves then to God, resist the devil, and he will flee from you. James 4.7 before we can start, we, before we start rebuking or resisting the devil, we must ask ourselves if we're fully surrendered and submitted to God. Submitting to God means fully abandoning our lives to Him, with our spiritual armor fully in place and prayer in our hearts. We're yielding, we're, we're yielding to the One who has the ultimate authority. We're given the strength to resist the devil when we surrender our entire lives to God, and then guess and. De and then guess what happens? The devil flees. Let <coughs> what we often try to do instead is force resist the devil or rebuke him when we have yet to really submit to God. Resisting the devil is hard when we haven't submitted our will, our ways and our wants to God. Submitting to God is the only is, is not only the first step, but our submission to God is actually us resisting Satan at the same time. We have the tools at hand. Let's take steps towards fully giving our lives to our good God. For when we do, the devil has no power over us. Prayer God, you equip us with tools to draw us closer to you and help us stand against schemes created to destroy us. Thank you for your protection. Thank you for caring for us at all times. Today, help me to intentionally put on all of the armor you freely offer me. Give me the strength to stand firm in you. In Jesus' name, Amen. Put on the full armor of God so that you can take your stand against the devil's schemes. Ephesians 6, 11.